out of Polk County. A deputy shot and killed a suspect during a traffic stop. News Channel 8's Jen Holloway is live in Lake Wales where Sheriff Grady Judd just wrapped up a press conference. Tell us more, Jen. Hey guys, well, we're literally in an unincorporated park of Lake Wales to be exact. We're at the intersection of Kimber Road and Glen Street Mary Road. Now all this started a bit earlier along State Road 60. The motorcycle involved reportedly doing more than 100 miles per hour. When deputies finally caught up with that motorcycle, they tell us they found him down the street here, his motorcycle overturned, and when they came up on the scene, unfortunately, according to the sheriff, he made the wrong decision to reach into his waistband and pull out a weapon. He pulled a gun, he started shooting, we started shooting. It would have been so much easier just to raise his hands and go to jail. I guess he believed he was state prison bound and he wasn't going to go there. And he was right, he's not going there. Because of his conduct, he's going to the medical examiner's office tonight. Sheriff Judd also told us earlier that he had reports that this young man by the name of Quentin Case, who had multiple uh, reports for his arrest, he was wanted on several things, that he had made comments to others that he would never go back to jail. And apparently he definitely is not, as you heard the sheriff say. The two deputies involved, Deputy Clifford Wofford and also Clayton Kokiu, they were not injured, thankfully. And tonight they are on administrative leave, as is regular in a case like this. But again, this young man, he lost lost his life here today because he pulled out a weapon and he pulled it on two deputies here in Polk County. Back to you. All right, Jen Holloway live in Lake Wales. Thank you. And we have